Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I am Shawnee Sanders. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Listen, if you're here for the first time, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that notification button because you want to know when I upload videos every week, which I do, and you want to know when. And also, if you like this video when you see it to the end, hit the thumbs up, drop a comment if you're going to like some of these things I'm about to show you. So, let's get into it. Today we're talking about my favorite things for April, and this is my drink edition, okay? I'm all about the drinks for April and the summer too, but we'll get into that later. So what I really got into really throughout 2021 is hard seltzers. And these happen to be some of my favorite hard seltzers that I truly like, truly punch, oh my God. If you're that kid that used to drink like um, fruit punch, jungle juice, you know, I'm telling my age by saying jungle juice, but just really fruit punch, you're gonna like truly punch hard seltzers. They're really good. They have, they have a sugar in it now, so you're gonna be, have to be careful with those, but they're really good and you're really gonna like those. If you are the health conscious person, but you want something refreshing and it has a nice um, fruity taste, but not overpowering, White Claw is gonna be your go-to. So White Claw has two packs. They have variety pack number one and variety pack number two. And this is number two and it has um, mango, lemon, watermelon, and tangerine. Variety pack number one is also really good. I can't remember the flavors in that one. I think it's like a blackberry, a blueberry, something like that. But it's really good. You're gonna love it. Throw them in a the cooler, put them on ice, drink it with something. I mean, mix it up. We're actually gonna make a mixed drink today too, so be ready for that. Mix them up with something, they're really good. I'm telling you, not gonna be still wrong with White Claw. White Claw is just vodka water. That's all it is, vodka water with a plat, with like a splash of just some type of flavor. A hint of like the mango, a hint of like lemon and watermelon. But you're gonna love them if you're looking for something that's gonna be healthy for you during the summer. Next up, we have Bud Light Hard Lemonade Seltzers. I love these. I drink these all the time. Between this and White Claw, I mean, I'm on these all day. I love the flavors. And the thing about seltzers and hard seltzers at that is that I'm not a beer person. Like, I don't like to drink beer. I've never been that girl. But when they came out with hard seltzers, I was just like so completely. Because these particular hard seltzers, especially White Claw, they don't have any beer taste. So we know Bud Light Seltzer, of course, is a beer base. Um, type of um, seltzer. White Claw is a vodka based seltzer. Truly Punch is also a beer based seltzer as well, but they're really good. But if you're not a beer drinker and you don't really like that flavor of beer, this is going to be your go-to. Even if you are a beer drinker and you still like that flavor, you're still going to like hard seltzer. I'm telling you, you're going to love them and make sure you drop a comment and let me know that you tried them out, okay? So listen, I came on here today because like I said, these are my favorite things for April. These are my drink additions. And I want to make a drink called a uh, hard seltzer um, sangria. So I'm going to get my stuff. I already got my little cup together. And this recipe calls for white claw, some juice. You can use fruit punch. You can use pineapple juice. This is lemonade. You can use whatever juice that you want to use in your drink. I think it'll all turn out just fine. You're gonna need some fruit, and you're gonna need some rosé. And these are really all the things you need to make the recipe. And I love sangria. I love serving sangria during the summer, on hot days, when I have friends over. I love sangria for brunch. I'm just a really big sangria fan, which is why I decided to do this particular recipe. But, you know, there's so many different salsa recipes online that you can find. You can go to Total Wine for those recipes. They have a lot of seltzers and beer recipe, cocktail recipes that you can use, and you're gonna love them, I'm telling you. You just don't even know. So, the way this recipe goes, and listen, I'm not a bartender, so don't expect for me to do this by the measurements because I'm not going to. I'm just going to pour this myself and drink it to my own taste, my own taste that I like. So first thing I'm gonna do is that I'm going to open my white claw. I'm gonna get something for my, um, to put my fruit inside. And the customer girl like to entertain you always have things like this in the house. So I'm gonna throw those, some pineapples. I'm gonna throw some strawberries. I love pineapples and strawberries. I love fruit in my drinks. I don't know about you guys. I love fruit in my wine when I drink it. I mean, I'm just that kind of girl. Not everybody is that way, but I am definitely that way. That's that. That's just me. I'm that girl that will put fruit in almost everything I drink. 
<laughs> That's just my thing about it. So I'm gonna pour some white claw in. And as you can see, it looks like water because it's vodka water and it's healthy. It's only a hundred calories. You can drink these and feel good about yourself the next day. And you're not gonna have a hangover, and you're not gonna get that beer belly and all that kind of stuff. It's simple. And now you're gonna add some rose. Right? It smells good already, I gotta tell you. I'm loving it already. And then I like I said, I got some lemonade. And you're gonna just add some lemonade to it to give it just a really good flavor. And then you just give yourself a spoon. And you're just gonna mix it up. That's it. Just mix it up. Look at that, look how the fruit look inside of there. Don't you just love that? I mean, I love that kind of stuff. I love to see fruit inside of things. Like, it just makes them look so much more, I don't know, just like, I don't know, just appetizing to me. And this is a dream. This is your heart seltzer sangria. I'm gonna try it and let you guys know what I think. This is good. No, this is really good. You're gonna wanna try this. This is really good. I might drink this whole thing while I'm just, I might just sit here and record this video and let you guys watch me drink this. Because it's quite delicious. You're gonna, you're gonna love it. So remember, the recipe calls for white claw, you choose your flavor, a rose wine, you're gonna wanna add some juice, whatever juice you like. I really think the recipe called for like a fruit juice. But I'm not a really fruit juice kind of girl. Like I love a lemonade, I'm good with that, but I'm not a fruit juice kind of girl. So it calls for uh, fruit juice. And also you can garnish it with like lemons or limes. And like I said, I just chose to throw in some um, fruits in it because I love my cinnamon with fruit. So listen, that's it. I just wanted this to be a quick video, but these are my favorite things for April. I am all about the drinks in April. <laughs> That's what I was all about. I was all about the drinks. And also, I'm gonna introduce you guys to something that you probably never had before and you never did even, and you didn't even know even existed. It's called Vodka Pops. Yeah, Vodka Pops. If you're a big fan of ices, you know what ices, like in the pack and you know, you tear it off and you'll eat that like all day, your tongue get blue, red or green or yellow, depending on the flavor you have. Well, I'm gonna introduce you to Vodka Pops. They are my number one favorite thing for the summer. Besides hard seltzers, they're my number one favorite thing for the summer. They're cold, they're easy. I can bring them to barbecues. I can bring them to family gatherings. You're not gonna get drunk off of them, but they're just a nice, cool, light and refreshing type of taste. You're going to love them. I can't wait to show you guys Vodka Pops. Also, I'm gonna give you guys my favorite wines for the summer. You know, if you haven't know by now, I'm really into like, wine, spirits, <laughs> you know, the high seltzers, vodka pops, I'm into those kind of things. So I'm give you some of my favorite wines for the summer. And also I give you some really cool spirits that you can try this summer that you might not have thought you would try. So listen, that's gonna do it for me. Thank you guys for tuning in. These are my favorite things for the month of April. Um, I really hope you guys enjoy it. I hope you guys go out and try White Claw, Truly, Bud Light. Listen, I am not sponsored. This video is not sponsored. These are just truly my favorite things. These are just the things that I go to the store and I buy at least, I don't know, every two weeks if when I run out. I just replenish them and I make sure I have them so when guests come over, you know, I introduce people to these and they be so shocked when they drink them. Because they never thought that they would actually like, like hard seltzers. You know, especially those who are loyalists to their spirits and things of that nature. They never thought they would even like these kind of things. But they're so easy. You can throw them in a cooler. You can go to like a festival or something, you know, and throw them in a cooler, take them in a barbecue. They're just easy to carry. They're just the perfect thing for summer and for outdoor activities. So like I said, thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you guys try some of these hard seltzers. Leave me some comments below. Let me know how you like them. Let me know if you try this recipe. Like I said, it's quite good. I can't stop drinking it. I'll probably just drink the whole thing for the rest of the day and just get it done. But I hope you guys liked it. So listen, I'm Shawnee Sanders. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you try some and let me know how you like it. I'll see you guys next time.